We're getting comfy and cozy with Storytime on Nick Jr. Oh, that nostalgia hit me like a freaking brick. Anybody else remember watching Nick Jr. or Noggin or whatever the freak it was called? Uh, just me? Okay, but anyways, I remember these things from when I was little. There were these commercials where they would, there would be stories and they were like animated. It was like an animated commercial with stories for little kids. And I used to love these things. And I found one. Now, the quality doesn't hold up. It doesn't hold up at all, but I thought, why not talk about it? So the thing starts off as it always did. I think it was a new family every time. I can't really remember. But it was a little boy and his mom, dad, sister, probably. And um, I remember this vividly. They would, there's the old intro right there. They would always just go up to their room. And then they would pick out the story and they would have this little like animation thing that played. And I used to love these. I used to, I used to love watching these. I don't know why I just did. They were amazing to me because this is back when commercials weren't just full of advertisements and all but of random stuff. I just love these things and I just thought we'd watch a little bit of this, I guess. I just watched a little bit of this. Good lord, my nostalgia's kicking in. So it starts off. This dude marries this princess. And they live in the forest with his brother. So they're walking around, you know. Doing their own thing. And they see this golden deer right here. And the princess wants the dude to catch it for her. Well, husband and wife. So he goes after it. And then this dude's like, ooga booga. He jumps out the freaking bush, yo. He's like a badass. He goes out the bush. He kidnaps that princess. He spirals around the room. He goes everywhere. He flies off. And this dude's like, no, fam. And then um, there are these monkey dudes right there. You see them. Freaking pretty cool, yo. They go into this castle thing, my Bob, where she's trapped. And there's that king dude again. That freaking ooga booga man. So he's got a bow. And I just freaking love this sucker. It's like Goro. He just gets ready to shoot. He shoots him. It's actually really dark for what I remember. Jeez, yo. It's dark for Nick Jr. Um... I, dude, I freaking love these. And then the candles come on. I'm just making up this as I go because I, I don't, I can't feel bothered to listen to this whole thing. But I just really, I do enjoy doing these. These are fun. Just goofing off and t joking about things that are happening. So then she sleeps or he sleeps or whatever the frick. And that's going to conclude this thing right here. Um, If I want to, if you guys want to see some more of this, because I really enjoy doing that. That was a lot of fun just goofing off and making this kind of like ironic in a way uh if you guys want to see more of that let me know and i'll look for more stuff that i remember as a kid i do remember a whole show that i used to love as a kid so i could do a longer one of these if you guys would want that i just like goofing off and trying to be funny and i hope you guys enjoyed this this was a blast from the past and i hope it was worth watching so yeah let me know if you guys want to see some more of these i have the question right here and uh yeah let's freaking hope making fiends will happen my boys